Hi everyone, I'm Jen Allen. Let's get moving right away because this is going to be a workout that only takes you less than 15 minutes long. As you roll those shoulders, feel those shoulders warm up. Take a deep breath in, exhale. This is a short, short, get the job done, no excuse for time workout. Take that again. Lift, lower. Now squat and reach forward. So, it's a heavy lifting workout. I'm actually using 15 pounders. We'll use the same weights for every move, and we'll go from move to move, getting the whole body worked out in 15 minutes or less. Reach forward, circle the right arm back. So muscle gaining, fat burning, heavy lifting. Remember, you're not a failure if you cannot finish every move. That means you're a success. Both arms at the same time this time. Circle, open the chest. One more. Now step wide, swing down and up. I will not do more than eight reps on every move. So again, it is not a lot of repetition, so go heavy. Find your weights and let's get started. Pick up your weights, put them in your hand. I promise you, you'll get every body muscle, circle, every muscle in the body. Your shoulders back, do that again. Be in control of every move and make sure you work safely and if you can't do one rep with good quality then don't do it step to the right weights in front step together weights at the side left squat to the middle step out right squat to the middle step out left good again to the right to the left one more time on each side. As you step together, hands at your side and just squat down, up. Seven. Four to go, that's all. Four. So if you find the workout, it's too easy. It's time to add more weight. As you come up on the next squat, right arm forward, left arm back, cross country. Now that's just four on each side. Let's do four more. Three, remember if it feels too heavy, you're done, that's okay. Step your feet wide, bring your weights in front of you. Plie squat eight times. Wide knees, combination of legs and arms. Two more. Now as you come up on the next one, upright row the arms eight times up. Seven. Control the downward motion as well as the up. Three, two, one more. Step your feet together in a hammerhead position, bicep curl. Eight. Four more. Good, one more. Take the weights up, turn your palms to face the shoulders. In an Arnold press over your head, coming back will move slowly eight times. Press up, turn the palms out, turn the palms in. Two, pull in. So biceps and shoulders, so far. Some legs, press, press, two to go. Press. If that felt easy, it's time for more weight. From here, bring your weights to the side. Soften the back of your knees. Hinge forward, bring your weights forward. Hinge open and up. So hamstring, back. Again, hinge. On this next one, hinge and hold. Take your palms, face each other, eight rows, go. Soft knees, bent over rows. Three, two, now hinge the body back up. Hinge it back forward. One more time, hinge up, hinge forward. Take the palms, face the legs with a wide elbow row, flare, go. Eight. Four more. Hinge 
hinge the body back up, hinge the body forward, hinge up one more time, hinge forward, turn your palms forward, row to the chest, eight, seven, not wasting any time here, four more. So we quickly go from one move to the other with smooth transitions. One more, stand upright, make sure you've got room behind you, place your weights at your shoulders. Rear lunge, right leg back. Come back up. We're gonna do four on each leg, so make them count. We won't do these fast, that's one. That's two. That's three. Just four more, big and deep. Nice and slow, last one. Step your feet wide. Place your weights down on the floor in front of you. One arm snatch, reach down and grab that right weight. Bring it over the head. One, come down. Other side, hold. That's one. Snatch, you're gonna use your abdominals here, your legs, your back, your shoulders. That's two. Love this move. Gets the whole body. That's three sometimes even the heart. Heart rate up a little bit. Burn in some calories. Here we go again. So in order to change the body and the way it looks, we need to change what we're lifting. We have two more. One more. Last one. Keep your feet wide, pick up the hand weight with your right hand. In a forward swing, abs in to going eight times. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Set it down, pick up the other weight with your left hand, get ready, go. Eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, one. Set it down, pick up the weight in your right hand, bring your feet close together, left hand on your thigh, hinge forward, outward reverse fly, eight times. This one might feel a little heavier than some of the others, so if you don't get them all, that's okay, you have four more. And if you get them all easily, remember it's time to use more weight. One more. Stand up, switch hands, hinge forward. Ready, go. Out, out. Four more. One more. Now carefully come down to the floor with one weight on each side. Take your elbows wide into a goal post position, into a bench press, abs in, press your weights up. Eight, this one's strong, seven, six, try to stop the elbows before they hit the floor, four, three, now I'm going to give you a little variation of this, bring it up and hold, squeeze the outside head into a V, open, three more times, up, squeeze, open, and two more, up, squeeze, last one, now bring them up and bring your palms together for a chest fly. Eight times, here we go. Open and close. This one might feel a little heavier than a bench press. So if you only get six, that's okay. If you only get four, that's okay. I would rather you get not all the repetition than all of them easily. Four more. Open, close, open, close. Two more times. So you want to have to really think about every repetition. One more. As you put your weights down, carefully bring your head above your heart. As you bring your head above your heart, make sure you're not dizzy. We are almost done. Bring it all the way up to standing. Bring your weight into your chest, holding it with both hands, sit into a squat. Now press forward. Pump, 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 pump. Four, three, two, and one. Stand up, bring the weight to your chest. Press up, so forward press. 
two, or overhead press with front shoulders, four, three, two, stay up, behind your head for triceps, down, press up, two, three, four, five, six, listen, seven, one more, eight, now bring it in front of your chest, up and behind your head, one, this is your last move of the day, behind your head, two, in front, behind, three, chest, shoulders, triceps, five, whew, six, seven, one more, and you are all done, and bring the weight down, let's do just a quick cool down, shake it off, take your feet wide, roll your shoulders, roll the shoulders, good, take your right arm, reach over, lift up, left arm reach over, and up, right arm reach over, and up, left arm reach over, and up, interlock your fingers together, push forward, drop the head between your arms, swing it to the right, knees are soft, swing it to the left, over the top of the head, over the top of the head, hands behind the back, open the chest, lengthen your bicep muscles all the way down, take your right foot behind you, pull it up into your hand, find your balance as you push down with your toe into your hand. Good, watch out for your weights as you take that right heel forward and pull back into your hamstring. Bring your feet together, take your left toe back, find your balance, pull it up into your hand. Push down with your foot, you'll feel a stretch in your bicep and a little more stretch in your thigh, quadricep. Watch out for your weights in front of you. Take that left heel forward, step back and pull back into your hamstring stretch. Again, you just work the entire body. Abs working all the time. If you want more abs, go to my fitness channel on YouTube, Fitness with Jen Allen, and do some Pilates work. Bring your feet together, take a big deep breath in, big exhale, and everything done in 15 minutes. No excuses, muscle gains, fat burning. Have a great day.